Hey, how are you? This is a quick video as to how to set up and register for Smart Exchange. Uh, Smart Exchange is a great website that gives teachers uh, free smart board lessons that are interactive for the kids and it is very easy to use. So all I did was open up Chrome and I'm going to simply search for Smart Exchange. And typically it's the first website that pops up. So I'm going to click on it here and as you can see it says Smart Exchange right on the top and what you are going to do is if you have an account already click sign in if not you're just going to simply click join for free it is free to join and fill out your information your email address uh, you're going to create your own password confirm your password choose a display name typically the first part of your uh, email will work first name last name and your country uh, check that you uh, are authorized and click agree and continue. What will happen is Smart Exchange will actually send you a confirmation email to make sure you are a real person. So just open up a second tab and go to your email. You should have received one from Smart Exchange and just confirm that you are actually a teacher. Once you receive that confirmation email, you can log back on to the Smart Exchange website and this time just click sign in. It's going to ask you to enter your email address. And password. And click sign in. You're now ready to search for lessons. Uh, what's great about Smart Exchange is you can search by title, whether you're looking for an attendance activity, a calendar activity, uh, word families. Uh, you could search by grade level, which is right here, kindergarten. Uh, you can also search by uh, the subjects that you want, uh, which is great. And uh, I'll just go ahead and do a simple kindergarten lesson. We look for a lesson that a lot of people have asked me for. Uh, this one's a attendance uh, lesson. It's uh, actually really cute. It's got two different options for you to do. It's it's a great way to do attendance and a, a lunch order. It's got your school lunch down at the bottom, home lunch down at the top, and what the children can do is drag their bird either to the tree for home lunch or drag it down to the fence uh, for a school lunch. So being that I know this lesson and I do want to download it, I'm just going to move right over here to download and click on it. And what will happen is that file will actually download onto your computer in your computer's download uh, folder. So you'll just have to locate that and open it up. Now simply locate your file in the downloads folder uh, and you will only have to double click on it because it is already in a smart notebook file. So once you double click it will automatically open in smart notebook. Once the file opens up, the only thing you're going to have to do is simply change the children's names to match your class. Uh, when you click on the, the bird, however, though, you can see that it's kind of locked together. The bird and the uh, name are combined. So what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to separate them in order to edit them. So you're going to simply click that down arrow, head down to grouping, and you're going to ungroup them. Now you can see there's an option to select just the bird or just the name. We'll select the name, and we'll just give that a change, change it to my name, and then we will select the two, click the down arrow, go back to grouping, and regroup them. Now when the student comes up and uses their finger or their pointer to move them, it will move both the bird and the name to either location that they want to move in. Uh, what I would suggest is once you change the names, uh, save it, and then give it a try by clicking on this full screen button right up here, and you'll have a great interactive uh, morning attendance and lunch order. Well, thank you for watching this five minute PD on Smart Exchange. I hope you found this helpful. Uh, if you look below in the description, there is a link to download a handout. There is also a link to the Educational Technology Specialist blog where you can find out other great tech tips and tech PDs.